I think you're faster than Tyler. No, he's not. not. Faster than me. You uh, really think you're faster? Can we than can we you switch think you're roommates? Faster than me. Yeah. Weston's the same speed as me? Has anyone watched us run? Everyone would know I'm faster than him. First of all, pace is criminal. That Brendan is faster than me. If you watch any game, he's never outrunning me. Tyler Adams is fed up with people not thinking he's fast. I think part of it is a lot of it happens off screen like that. So I think we should all just up, just not like he doesn't have to be like blazing. Let's all just up him a little bit in our estimation in terms of how fast he is. I think it would mean a lot to him. I'm a huge Ritz Crackers guy. Ritz Crackers sounds like a dreadful snack. That, clip is meant as an example of the type of reflexive negativity that Pool 6 kind of used to now, so he wasn't going to be too worried that everyone freaked out about those two missed chances. He just kept at it. He just kept going. And then everyone calmed down. Everything was fine. Which is exactly how he played with Ben. He just offered to go get him some rich crackers to try, and which he hadn't, he'd never had them before. So. Pool 6 did get a little hitch in the celebration there. You'll see it. It's small, but he's having to do this little walk with his knees and flailing that right arm. It's the whole whole thing's the movements on Tiger like so I think undermines the tattoo Tiger tattoo celebration. So let's just get that tighter. I like that Brendan Aronson turned this into a double head tap here. I don't know. I don't know exactly what the idea was, but I don't think it necessarily affected proceedings either. But it was just a little. It's actually kind of hard to come up with things to put in soccer videos, especially when it's supposed to be funny or something. I don't get it. this play was really good and should count. I think as an assist. I'm a little bit concerned about what's going on at the North Pole. For the first time ever, the FIFA World Cup will be played during the holiday season. They went Kicking and put the biggest sporting event on the planet smack in the middle of the holidays. Santa has known about this for months. He found out over the summer. They made an entire commercial about it. He got a call from an elf. Now he's acting like we sprung at him. It's not even clear to me why this is a, such a big problem for him. Just do your, do your job. It doesn't affect you.